Moving on now, the rising temperature and extreme heat being experienced in Sakwato State is giving residents a lot of concern. That's right, and they are advised to take precautionary measures against a possible outbreak of the deadly diseases such as meningitis. TVC News Suleiman Nasser has details. Sokoto is located in a tropical climatic area where the weather remains hot and dry throughout the 12-month calendar. The state is extremely hot at the moment and residents are faced with difficulties. By April, May, no amount of air condition in Sokoto in particular that will give you the conducive atmosphere you require. You need to find a shed to hide yourself. Residents are worried that the extreme heat being experienced may cause a possible outbreak of meningitis in the state. But this medical doctor allays fears expressed by residents on this matter. Before we declare that there is an outbreak, first of all, there, is, there must be an alert threshold before even epidemic threshold. And as I know right now, even from the Nigeria Center for Disease Control, as at last week, there is no single local government in Nigeria so far that is even within the alert phase. He stresses the importance of people taking precautionary measures to avoid being exposed to factors that favor the transmission of meningitis. People should, as, as much as possible, avoid living in overcrowded places, dormitories, in prisons, even in worship houses. In 2017, the outbreak of meningitis claimed many lives. The major challenge faced battling the outbreak of meningitis in Sokoto in 2017 was the non-availability of the vaccine for the type C string virus of meningitis. People's unwillingness to submit themselves to orthodox treatment, claiming the signs and symptoms of meningitis were signs of spiritual attacks, only worsened the matter. Most of our people have believed that it's, uh, it is a spiritual, but when we discover and uh, through social uh, enlightenment uh, campaign, that is not spiritual. Human activities such as cutting down trees and refusing to plant more trees has contributed in worsening the climatic conditions in Sokoto. In Sokoto here, we are in an area that trees, vegetation, is an important element. It's an important variable that should have been dowsing, that should have been cooling the area. But uh, ironically, these trees are being caught day by day. According to the Nigeria Center for Disease Control, in 2017, over 8,000 cases of the disease were reported across Nigeria, and 93% of the cases were concentrated in five northern states. Salkoto, Zamfaran, Katsina were the worst hit. Some of those who survived the scourge were left with defective hearing and speech problem. Sokoto, Zamfara, no longer the worst hit. It is now Everywhere. across the Everywhere. country, and it's so uncomfortable.